Another question is waiting for us to solve. Let's solve it by reading it. It says, evaluate this given integral. x raised to the power 4 plus 1 upon x squared plus 1 with respect to x. The question has been asked in the CBSC previous examination year 2002. Let me write solution and let's see what the question has to say. The question has numerator and denominator and the degree of the denominator although is 2, the degree of the numerator is greater than 2 which is 4. So in such cases when you have the degree as greater or equal to the denominator of the numerator, you have to follow long division. That is the best and the easiest approach to go for it. Let me do the long division. Here I have x squared plus 1. Here I have x raised to the power 4 plus 1. Now you know how to do it, right? So it is x squared here. It makes it x raised to the power 4. Then 1 and 2 x squared is plus x squared. I have minus x squared plus 1 this time. But here it is plus x squared multiplied by minus 1. So minus x squared minus 1. So the remainder is left as 2. So see, this is your remainder. And what is your quotient? Quotient is your x square minus 1. And this I can write it as my divisor. Now what you have to do after the long division? You have to simply follow q plus r upon d. I, v, i, s, o, r. That means q plus r upon divisor you have to follow and you have to just simply integrate. That will give you the answer. As simple as that. Let me adopt this methodology. Integration q. q is x square minus 1. Obviously with respect to x. Plus r. r is remainder upon divisor. Divisor is x square plus 1. And again with respect to x. Now just integrate and get the answer. q, squ uh, q square is not there. I mean it is x square. I am sorry. So it makes it x cube by 3 minus integration of 1 with respect to x is x plus 2 as a constant outside this is what 1 upon x square plus 1 let me not go with the other step let's do it there only now it is what it is something called as the whole squares addition and you know 1 upon x square plus a square is 1 by a tan inverse x by a so it is 2 1 by 1 tan inverse x by 1 plus c. Let me write it more clearly. The answer should be x cubed by 3 minus x plus 2 tan inverse x plus c. That is your answer to this question.